In today's video, I'm going to be talking about one of my favorite colors for designer bags, blue. It's such a versatile and timeless color that can elevate any outfit. So I put together a list of my top 10 blue designer bags that I think are worth investing in. From classic to trendy, there's something for everyone on this list. So grab a drink, get cozy, and let's dive into the world of blue designer bags. Okay, so the first one is a list. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you, we talked about this one, it's from Ferragamo, and I have this on my wish list. I was so close to checking out. For some reason, too, it's called something different on the Mount Teresa website. It's called the Ferragamo Gansini, but it's basically, it's really just the iconic top handle bag. So that's what we're gonna call it on this list. This light blue color is gorgeous against that silver. I won't continue to reiterate about this bag. I really love it though. It's trendy. I think it's classic too. And that's a great thing about it. It's a happy median. It's nice and structured. It has that beautiful silver hardware. Gorgeous top handle, feet on the bottom. Look how shiny that patent leather is. Oh my God. Interior zipper. I like the, the slit pocket in the inside. It's okay, but I much prefer a zipper in the inside. It just adds that extra level of security in case you want to put something in there. And I think it's also oh cute without the strap as well, the longer crossbody strap. Next on my list is from Bottega, Bottega Veneta. And this is the Candy Jody in Twin Swept. This blue is stunning. If it looks like this in store, it's absolutely beautiful. Now, I'm not sure if they have the mini Jody. I spe specifically wanted to do the candy Jody because I wanted it to be a little different. I always talk about the mini Jody and this is different. I could just imagine what would fit in this one. Trying not to think about it but I'm able to squeeze my bare necessities into my mini Jody. And this one is, was just too cute not to show you. But let's see, oh, discover other sizes. I know, I said that, I was dumb then. I'm smart now. <laughs> okay, so they do have a bigger version. That's nice that they do that now, they show that. So this comes in the mini, the teen, and the candy size. So it also comes in the mini Jody for 2650. So in case that candy Jody is just out of your, just out of the question, as far as size, there are bigger size options, which is great. This one. O M G, this color, this hue. Oh my God. It's the Loewe Goya Puffer Small Velvet Shoulder Bag. So, some of you may be saying, okay, velvet isn't for summer, spring. Who cares? Okay, who cares? You can wear what you want. I'm gonna wear what I want. Okay, I'm just telling you. But the color of this bag, I have not seen it. It has antique gold hardware, has a chain strap. I do wish the style was slightly different. I do like the puffer style, but I don't know. The color is calling my name, but not necessarily bag. That makes sense. It has a nice wide open and zippered interior, and it just looks so soft and so cozy. I love it. I actually saw this bag in Neiman. I didn't see this particular color, but online it's stunning. So I'll be curious to see it in person. Also, if you're enjoying this video, please like and subscribe so you don't miss any of my luxury fashion and designer bag content. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. The next bag on my list I actually have is the Jacquemus Le Bambino Long in light blue. This is what it looks like. I'm still loving it. It's actually a current bag that I'm using. I have some stuff in here. Um, it does have a pack pocket that's pretty useless. I wouldn't put anything out there. It's merely for decoration. It can only be worn as a shoulder bag. You can't cross by it or anything like that. That's the downside, but I still like it. I still think it's great. Quickly flipping back to Bottega Veneta, I could not pass up telling you about this pool color also that they have in this mini Jody. Now, I'm showing you the mini Jody, but they have other styles, y'all know this. They have the cassette, the panic cassette, and things like that. So if you don't like this style, look at this color in other styles. This color is gorgeous. It's similar to the color of my button down, and it's like a turquoise blue. That's what it looks like. It's a gorgeous shade. I don't have to talk about that bag again, but it's still trending. It's still classic in my opinion, and it is quiet if you're into that thing. Next bag I have to share with you is the Velextra the Eye Side Blue Leather belt bag and this is what it looks like it's also a quiet option for those of you who don't like a lot of logos it has a top handle even though it's a belt bag too you can wear it as a shoulder crossbody bag because it has the longer strap that you can do whatever you want with it if you don't like blue it does come in other colors too just wanted to share that with you so for next option i wanted to share two options with you it's under the same number because the same brand i guess i could have done that for bottega veneta too this is the alexander mcqueen i don't really talk about their bags because i don't typically like them but i love this one oh and this is the Alexander McQueen medium skull tote bag. Top handle, skull on the front is quite minimal and it has a longer strap too. I just love the gradient blue. I love the silver hardware. Perfect combination. This is a beautiful bag. Also has a back pocket. Alexander McQueen is on the back too, so it's pretty quiet. Oh, I love this. 
I typically don't like their bags, but I really like this one. I also want to show you this other option from Alexander McQueen, which I thought was just phenomenal. This is the Mini Jewel Skull Chain Satchel Bag. Can you look at this? Can you look at the crystals? Now, I don't know about, I'm sure it's pretty high maintenance. Maybe not, I might be wrong, but I guess that silver, the different sizes of jewels on the bag. Oh, the black in the corners. Oh my God. Like the perfect going out bag too. Black leather on the inside too. Inner slot pocket, longer strap if you wanna wear it as a crossbody. I really like this one. Next we have an option from Fendi. This is the Mini Montresor leather bucket bag. Another bucket bag. Actually, I talked about a bucket bag in another video, not this one. Fantastic. This one is in the lagoon color. I love this one. It has a top handle as well. It has a front zippered pocket, which is nice. And I'm sure it has a longer strap. Yes, it does, which is beautiful. I like this one. If you like bucket bags, it's a great price point too, $17.90 for a full leather bag, which is pretty, you know, rare these days. It looks like it's pretty sizable. You could put your bare necessities in it and everything. Next bag I have for you is from Dolce & Gabbana. It's the medium devotion bag in quilted nap leather. This royal blue is stunning. I do think with the uh, antique gold hardware, it kind of amps it up a little bit as far as it being dressy, but that's okay. It's quite nice. And it does have a longer strap with a leather in the middle in case you want to rock it shoulder across body cross body cross body style and it's pretty roomy inside this style also comes in so many different colors they release them season after season which is nice that's what the interior looks like it has an inner zipper pocket too and then next we have a mombri it's the little softy in portobello blue crinkled metallic leather oh my gosh it's very nice that chain strap is nice as well oh interior pocket nice and roomy inside oh just look at it it is like the most divine metallic blue i've ever seen like it really is it really really is i love it as you see there's no shortage of amazing designer blue bags out there let me know in the comments which one i missed and which one is your favorite don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more luxury fashion and talking all about designer bags if you enjoyed this video i'll link my green designer bag video in case you haven't already seen it or some other video that you may have missed. Talk soon.